Now, California is trying to set up an earthquake early warning system. KPIX 5's Devin Feely shows us how it would work and the obstacles to getting it up and running. The U.S. Geological Survey says an earthquake early warning system is still years away from widespread use in California, despite the fact that the technology is already in place and working in countries like Mexico and Japan. The other systems in the world were built after large, damaging, and in many cases, high fatality events. And those earthquakes produced the political will to invest in building an early warning capability. An early warning system could give people a few seconds, perhaps even a minute of warning before an earthquake struck. But despite the ever-present danger, California's system has been hampered by a lack of funding and other technological challenges. Currently, the state has built roughly half, 859, of the nearly 1,700 earthquake monitoring stations it needs to detect quakes and alert the public. And the biggest issue is funding. This system is simply not fully funded. The USGS estimates it will cost roughly $38 million to complete construction and another 16 a year to maintain the system. Researchers are sharing alerts with a handful of public agencies like BART or the Menlo Park Fire Department, where the information is used to slow or stop trains or roll up the firehouse doors before the shaking starts. But the one place you won't get an alert, at least not this year, will be on your phone. The technology simply isn't there to guarantee that everyone will get a timely alert through a cell phone. Uh, we'd like to do that, but it's simply not technologically possible. The USGS says cell phone alerts are likely three to seven years away, a long time when the next major quake can hit with a moment's notice. In Menlo Park, Devon Feely, KPIX 5.